Welcome to my channel, Break This Snow. Hi friends, if you are using Minox Dill or want to start Minox Dill or if you have hair loss and planning to start using Minox Dill, then you must watch this video. Do you know some facts about Minox Dill? Can we use Minox Dill on receding hairline? Can I stop Minox Dill whenever I want? Can I use more than 5% of Minox Dill? Can women use Minox Dill 5%? To know all these facts, you must watch this video. So this is all my personal opinion and should not be considered as, as a medical advice. Always talk to your doctor before starting any new medicine. Minoxidil is a vasodilator medicine. Which is available over the counter to treat androgenic alopecia or male pattern baldness. Also, it treats female hair loss. This is the only FDA approved topical hair loss treatment in men and women. Minoxidil actually works. Minoxidil definitely works for most people with a genetic hair loss or androgenetic alopecia. You will usually notice results from 3 to 6 months. How Minoxidil works? Actually, no one really knows how it works. Minoxidil is a vasodilator. It is known to improve microcirculation to the hair follicles by allowing more oxygen and blood to the follicles. This may cause initial shedding of the follicles, which are then replaced by stronger and thicker hair. That's why when people start using minoxidil, they experience a lot of hair shedding in first two to four weeks but after that it stabilizes and they get back the hair new hair and thicker hair again how long should i use it minoxidil should be used lifelong or forever in order to support existing hair follicles and to maintain any new hair growth you should use minoxidil forever what happens if i stop minoxidil if you stop minoxidil, you will start losing the hair growth which occurred due to the minoxidil. In other words, all the new hair due to the minoxidil is going to go away. Where can I get the minoxidil? It is available over the counter online in several brands and forms. Rogaine is one such brand. It is available commonly as minoxidil 2% 5% and 10% The percentage represents the amount of actual medicine The other part is just alcohol I have used in the past several brands including Kirkland Minoxidil Rogaine Hims Minoxidil Also some brands from India like Mintop 14 More F 5% Amexanil 5% days. This is from Ranbaxi. Two gain from Sipla. Currently, I am using Amexanil from Ranbaxi. I like this because it this comes with a spray and aerosol. You can get minoxidil in several forms like spray. So this one is a spray, liquid, gel, and foam. I personally prefer aerosols or spray because it's easy to apply. This is what I am using currently, which is MXDIL 5% A's. However, any brand of Minoxidil will work the same way. Now, can women use Minoxidil? Yes, women can use Minoxidil 2% A's. Minoxidil 2% A's is the only recommended drug for women who suffer from hair loss or female pattern baldness. Women use 2% A's formula, while men use 5% A's formula. When should I start using Minoxidil? Losing up to 100 hairs in a day is common. If you are losing more than 100 hairs and you are experiencing hair thinning, you should check with your doctor and start using Minoxidil. Minoxidil controls and treats androgenetic alopecia. What is actual dosage of Minoxidil? We should apply just 1 ml of 5% Minoxidil on the scalp. Do it two times a day with 12 hours of gap. 
Some people like me will use it just once a day. It's okay. I usually prefer applying at bedtime. Once in a day, that's fine. But it is recommended to use twice a day so that you can see the benefits better. For females, the dosage is the same except that they use 2% days instead of 5% days. Usually these bottles like this are fitted with calibrated spray nozzles. These spray nozzles are calibrated ones. So in this case, 8 sprays is equal to 1 ml. So I just spray this on my head 8 times which will give me 1 ml. They also have this dropper. The dropper has got the 1 ml measurement precisely. So you can just take the 1 ml and you can spread it over your scalp wherever you have hair loss and you can just spread it with your fingers. Let's look at in detail how to use minoxidil or how to apply minoxidil. If you have an aerosol like this, you have to spray 8 times to get 1 ml of minoxidil. Some aerosols have different calibrations. So read the guide and know how many sprays is equal to 1 ml. So in this case I sprayed 8 times then it's equal to 1 ml. In order to apply this minoxidil, separate your hair and spray this on the scalp, right on the scalp. And with the help of fingers, gently rub this liquid to cover the entire scalp and wash your hands right after that. Make sure you never touch other body parts with this liquid. For example, if you're touching your face, you may experience some unwanted hair growth on your face, especially for females. You should not touch it on your face with this liquid. You just wash it clearly with water. Otherwise, you may experience some unwanted hair growth which you don't want. So the question comes, why did I stop using minoxidil? I had used minoxidil for two years continuously. And then I decided I should stop it for some time because I have experienced several side effects and some of them are here. Minoxidil does not work on your receding hairline or frontal baldness. So if you are applying minoxidil here, it's not going to work. It works only on the crown area. It must be used continuously and if you stop, the hair growth due to minoxidil is going to shed away. You get a lot of irritation on the scalp when you leave minoxidil for more than two days. So you have to wash your hair regularly for every two days. Minoxidil makes your hair dry. Because it is alcohol based, alcohol dries out your hair badly. So if you have already a dry hair, then it's going to make it more worse. It may cause white flakes on the scalp. These are dried alcohol combined with the dirt. These white flakes are irritating and you may want to get rid of them as soon as possible by washing your hair. This sometimes causes itchy scalp you feel like scratching your head and it may cause rashes too. So if you have sensitive scalp, you might want to check whether minoxidil works for you or not and slight dizziness. Whenever I overdose minoxidil or whenever I use it too much, sometimes I use derma roller or scalp roller, I think a lot of medicine gets into my head and it gets absorbed. This causes dizziness and uh, if you get too much of dizziness, you should immediately check with your doctor. Anxiety You may sometimes experience slight anxiety. That's okay. It may or may not be due to minoxidil, but you may sometimes experience some kind of anxiety due to this minoxidil. These are what I have experienced. However, there are some other side effects documented but I have never experienced myself. They are fainting, chest pain, irregular heartbeat, dizziness, swelling of hands, feet, unusual weight gain, tiredness and difficulty breathing. So if you experience any of these kind of side effects, you should contact your doctor immediately. So these are the main reasons why I stopped minoxidil after using for two years. Again, I have started using now because the side effects are very minor when compared to the actual hair growth so I get from minoxidil. 
what are the precautions? If you are pregnant or have any health conditions or allergies, talk to your doctor before starting this. Will I get benefit from using more than 5% of minoxidil? This is a common question. No, you don't get any benefits if you use more than 5% of minoxidil. I personally used 10% of minoxidil, but I did not get any benefits. So stick to 5% which is recommended for women, 2% is recommended. So stick to these doses. So don't try to overdose yourself. So that's about minoxidil. From this, you might have learned what were the side effects of minoxidil and what you should be expecting from minoxidil if you are using it continuously. If you feel the side effects are minor and if you want real health growth, go ahead and start using minoxidil. But please check with your doctor before taking any decision. Um, in my case, the side effects are very really minor. I thought like I will continue using minoxidil. So even though I have stopped for uh, six months, and now I wanted to use it again. So that's about it. Thank you so much. Bye bye. Please like our video and subscribe. Tap on bell notification to get more interesting videos.